And when they came to Marah, they could not drink of the waters of Marah, for they were bitter. Therefore the name of it was called Marah. And the people murmured against Moses, saying, What shall we drink? Exodus chapter 15, verses 23 to 24. Hello, everyone. Did you know that tomorrow is World Water Day? Held every year on March 22nd since 1993, World Water Day focuses on the importance of fresh water and gives us an opportunity to consider certain facts about water in the world. We are very privileged to be living in Quebec since the St. Lawrence River takes its water from the Great Lakes, where 20% of the world's supply of fresh water may be found. It's a water supply we can count on for farming, industry, business, and our homes. But what about elsewhere? Over 2.2 billion people do not have access to clean water. Diseases caused by polluted water kill one child every eight seconds. During this time of Lent, let us reflect on what water means to us. This year's World Water Day theme is about what water means to people, its true value, and how we can better protect this vital resource. The value of water is m about much more than its price. Water has enormous and complex value for our households, culture, health, education, economics, and the integrity of our natural environment. If we overlook any of these values, we risk mismanaging this valuable resource. Water and soap against the coronavirus. Hand hygiene is essential to containing the spread of COVID-19, as well as other infectious diseases. On this World Water Day and any other day, remember to wash your hands regularly with water and soap or with an alcohol-based hand gel. See UNICEF's guidelines on hand washing and UN Water's fast facts on hand washing and hand hygiene. If you can, why not make the donation to an organization like Development and Peace? Visit the website address below on, or the One Drop Foundation website at www.onedrop.org for more information. Happy World Water Day, everyone!